What happens if you use molasses to liquid cool a computer? This commenter has been suggesting this for over 275 days straight. And so to honor their dedication, we're gonna throw together a custom cooling loop and break open a fresh can of molasses to pour directly into our reservoir. And oh yeah, that's looking crisp. However, as we go to turn on our computer, well, nothing happens. Molasses by itself is too viscous for the pump to handle, but thankfully we can cut it with H2O. By adding just a little bit of water, we can reduce the viscosity and allow the molasses to flow through this computer's veins. The sugar cane that made all this ought to be real proud of how far its molasses has come. But now the true test, how well does this perform? Well, under no load, we're sitting at just under 30 degrees Celsius, which honestly is pretty impressive. But the true, true test is putting this under 100% load, which if we do that, we can see it steadily rise and rise. And in response, our pump begins working overtime, settling our temperature at under 60 degrees Celsius without any thermal throttling. This is crazy. It turns out molasses is great at liquid cooling a computer. The longevity of it though is still to be determined. <laughs>